In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to delegate access to a Google Workspace user's email. This is a handy feature that allows you to empower a colleague or assistants to manage emails on your behalf, ensuring your communication runs smoothly even when you're caught up in other tasks. To get started, open your web browser and navigate to Google Workspace. Once you're there, the next thing to do is click on the admin console. You'll need to log in using your business email credentials, so make sure you have those handy. Enter your email, follow through with your password, and then proceed by clicking next or sign in. Once you're logged into the admin console, you'll notice a Google Apps menu at the top right corner of your screen. Go ahead and click on it. Within this menu, you'll be looking for the admin icon. It should be easily recognizable and will lead you to the core settings of your Google Workspace account. With the admin console open, you will next click on Apps, which is typically found in the navigation pane. As you explore further into the Apps section, locate and click on Google Workspace. This area houses all your key tools within Google Workspace, including Gmail. Upon entering Google Workspace, look for the Gmail option and click it. This will take you to all the settings related to your email service. Now what you need to do is seek out the user settings. It's through this section that you'll be able to manage a variety of settings tailored to individual users including mail delegation. Click on mail delegation. Here you will see an option that allows users to delegate access to their mailbox to other users within your domain. You'll want to ensure that you check the box next to let users delegate access to their mailbox to other users in the domain. By checking this box, you are enabling users in your organization to give others access to their email. This is crucial for teamwork and productivity, especially for those who need to manage large volumes of communication regularly. Once you've checked the box, don't forget to click on Save to apply these changes. It's always important to confirm that your settings are saved properly to avoid having to repeat the process. And just like that, you've successfully set up email delegation in your Google Workspace account. Remember, delegating access is not just about sharing your inbox with someone else, it's about enhancing your workflow and ensuring that important communications are handled efficiently. Whether you're stepping out for a meeting or just need another set of hands to manage your email load, this feature will be an invaluable tool in your productivity arsenal. Thanks for watching and I hope you found this guide helpful.